Sarah Palin and her clan continues uh, to remind the public that um, John McCain is near treasonous uh, for his actions in nominating Sarah Palin as the vice presidential candidate for the Republicans in 2008. And now uh, we have an account from an Alaskan blogger at first, Amanda Coyne, who uh, wrote that there was some form of unofficial birthday Iron Dog type snow machine party in Anchorage. Iron Dog uh, is uh, some type of like uh, dog racing uh, competition up there. The Palins show out, and they fall out of their stretch Hummer. <laughs> Track Palin gets into a fight with an ex-boyfriend of his sister, Willows. And then there's an all-out brawl. The Palin clan is screaming. And as they are jumping back into their stretch Hummer, Sarah Palin screams, don't you know who I am? As if the stretch Hummer and all of these morons piling out of it at the same time was not an indication of who they were. I imagine everybody at the party knew who they were. Well, apparently, this information came, in addition to being corroborated with the police to some extent, came from Eric Thompson, who was an eyewitness at the party. He was invited by his boss... And he went on. He went on um, Good Morning America to tell uh, them what he saw. Let's hear from Eric Thompson. Lively party erupting into a fight. Bristol Palin allegedly throwing a right hook. Bristol just reached back and start clocking him, and she hit him. You know, reached way back here and caught him right in the chin, like. You know, I counted at least six times. Eric Thompson says he was one of 70 guests at a birthday party in Anchorage on Saturday. According to political blogger Amanda Coyne, Palin, along with her husband Todd and kids Bristol, Willow and Track, arriving in a stretch Hummer. Coyne also reporting that as the beer started flowing, that's when the fighting started. They were knocking his head back, and he was straightening his head back up, and he'd get hit again. And The Palin family was asked to leave the party after Track Palin allegedly attacked another party guest who had previously dated his younger sister, Willow. That's when the 21-year-old's father stepped in to break up the fight. Once the fight was broken up, the former vice presidential candidate and her family left. I heard Sarah Palin scream out, you know who we are, don't you? It was like we were just on a Jerry Springer episode. <laughs> Anchorage police only telling ABC News that members of the Palin family were indeed attending a party at this home Saturday night when a fight erupted outside. The police seemed to show up right after they left. You know, asking people questions and wanting to know what was going on. And Overnight, Sarah Palin appeared on Fox News' Hannity Show. There you go. <laughs> To give, uh, I gotta go do some national security analysis. So when this conflict over the meth profits is sorted out, and my daughter's dating schedule, I gotta go talk about why Barack Obama has been very irresponsible with Todd, our policy vis-a-vis -vis the Shia. Let's get this stretch Hummer to the uh, Fox affiliate. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, Eric Thompson, uh, the. Um, the witness who went on Good Morning America has been fired by his boss. Who oh. threw the party? Oh, boy. Well, unbelievable. Almost our man.